might have seen officials of the National ID Authority around where you live. Uh, the mass registration is on. Wherever you are, you need to uh, take the opportunity and be part of it. My guest this morning is the Assistant Commissioner of Immigration, uh, Francis Pamdetti, who is Acting Corporate Affairs Director of the Authority. He's here with me in the studio. Good morning. Good morning. Grateful for your time. My pleasure. So, how is it so far? Uh, it's great that needed to make a quick mm. clarification. We are actually in Accra West. Accra West. Accra West. For now. Is, yes. Not the whole of Greater no, Accra. No, not the whole of Greater Accra. Accra West is made up of 14 constituencies. Mm. Um, the Okaikwe, Ablekuma, Odododio, um, the Anya area. So it's made up of 14 municipalities. We moved to Accra East. Right. From the 4th of June to the 6th of July. So Accra East is uh, Lejokuku, Kole Klote, Krowo, mm. um, Shai Osudoku, Tema. East and West, Ada, East and West, um, uh, Bunkata Manso, Pram Pram, mm. and um, th those make up the 70 constituencies we'll be tackling come 4th June. From 4th June. June to July. Okay. So, get the whole of Greater Accra, it, we started on the 29th of April and we'll end on the 6th. So, it's been divided into, into two. two. Yes. So, now you are on the, uh, on the, the western west side. side. Yes. And uh, so, on the 4th of June, June you're moving to, to the, the east, east side. side yes. Right. How has it been so far? So far, I say it's been good. We we are happy about the turn up. I mean, you could tell that people are quite enthusiastic, are eager to get their card, mm. and we're happy about that. We would also would want um, the community to get themselves very much involved. Mm. Yesterday, um, it was reported today in the media that we had um, the police had arrested some official of ours who mm. was trying to help a foreigner register. It was the supervisor of the center who um, noticed what was going on and reported to the police to have him arrested. Mm. We think that uh, we, if anything is happening within our walls, mm. we should expose it. And that is what the official did. We also urge um, community members. The reason why we are registering in the community is because... We'll, we'll come to talk about okay. the public support for what is happening. Yeah. But how, how solid is, is your system such mm. that that officer mm -hmm. was able to be arrested following perhaps the vigilance of mm -hmm. a supervisor of, of, the, of your, one of your stations? The, the systems we are running has various protocols. Mm -hmm. And when we sit back, we, f we find it silly for that officer to attempt to, make, to go ahead with that. Because when you come to work, before you sit behind the machine, mm -hmm. you must use your Ghana card to log in. So there's always a trail of who has registered, who has touched the system, who has done anything on the system. Once you're on the system, there's a trail. So the official who would do the investigation would first have to look through the forms, interview the applicant, mm -hmm. pass on to the next person who keys in the information. All of them in the center, their details are tied to the record. Mm -hmm. So at no point will there be any investigations and we'll know those directly involved. So even if it happens, the system can track the yes, person, absolutely. the officer who might have Registered engaged in that illegality. Precisely. Even the commissioner for oath, let's assume that the person who came registering did not have any of the documents and so opted for vouching. Mm. The person who vouched for, the officer for oath who um, at attended to him, and all those in the chain, their records will be in the system. So we keep telling people that um, even if you are not detected and you are able to go through the system. Mm. It's just a matter of time. Once we get to know that you were ineligible and you had yourself in our system, we would, all those in the chain would be sanctioned. Who helped you to get to, to get it to be sanctioned. Once you, it turned out that you had some foreknowledge and you supported the exercise in having this ineligible applicant receive a card, Prosecution will affect you as well. Let, let's look at the, the public. What can they do? What can we do to support a clean exercise? We, we are urging, in fact, the reason why we are in the communities mm. and also urging community members to take advantage of the exercise and not have people coming from elsewhere is that in the community, you know those in the community. You can tell those who are eligible and those who are ineligible. So when an applicant comes and you think that that person is not qualified to register, you can raise a challenge. The previous law just made provision for the registration officer to raise a challenge. Mm. But now it has been opened to any member of the community at all 
who has any issue with anybody who he thinks is not qualified to register can raise an objection. And we want that to go on. We shouldn't just mama or grumble in the, in the crowd. Mm. If we think somebody is not qualified, step up, let the official know you have an objection, you think this person is not qualified, and that will be done. So we think that public support in terms of being vigilant, helping the process to be clean, is encouraged. This national identity register is made for purposes of public interest. Mm. And so we all have a stake in it. And I believe that if everybody, officials and the public alike, work closely together, we can have a very clean um, and credible database that will benefit all of us. In, in wrapping up, uh, give me the uh, west uh, side of Accra where you're doing and then top up with the east that will be going on June 4 and then we'll wrap up. Okay, so we have um, Gan South, mm. Gan West, um, Gan North and Gan Central. Okay, Gan South, Gan West, West North and, and Gan Central. Central. Amasaman, Man, uh, Weja, Anya, Anya Sowutuom. So those people areas. around there. Yes. Right. Um, Odomia, Brow, Boom, mm. etc. Now we also have Ashedu uh, Keteke, which is Odododio. Right. Then we have um, uh, Ablekuma. Mm. Ablekuma South, Central, North, and West. The Dansuman areas, area. Mataiko, around Dakuman, and the rest. Yes. And then we have Okaikwe. Mm. Okaikwe, North, Central, Bubuashi, and West. Kaneshi, uh, around there. Exactly. Everyone there who is listening or watching, we need to get there and be part of it. But those of you on the other side, mm -hmm. perhaps if you're beginning to ask questions why they are not there yet, he says June 4th. 4th. Yes. You're coming there. Yes. The areas again. Um, we have um, Kole Kulote, mm -hmm. Dosu area, mm -hmm. Laboni, um, we have Krowo, Ladade Kotopong, Lejokuku, mm -hmm. um, Tema East and West, uh, Ada East and West, um, Shai Osudoku, mm -hmm. Ashaman, um, bon -katamanso. Bon -bon -katamanso. Mm -hmm. They make up Accra East. All right. And so, all of you there, you are waiting uh, for them to be there. Assistant Commissioner of Immigration, Francis Pamdetti, uh, Acting Director, Public Affairs of the National ID Authority. I'm grateful for your time once My again. Pleasure.